the real-time real estate segment today being brought to you by rsrmoney.com. rsrmoney.com. How long will it take to sell my house? You want your house to sell fast? And you may be wondering, you may be wondering how long the whole process is going to take. One way to get your answer, work with a local real estate agent. They have the expertise to tell you how quickly homes are selling in your area and what's impacting timelines for other sellers. That way you have realistic expectations that can work together to come up with a plan that's based on today's market. I will share with you, if you want to know the exact numbers of what the time is for your market, your zip code, go to rsrlinks.com slash market report rsrlinks.com slash market report. Alto's research tra uh, tra tracks every home for sale in the United States every week. And they come up with the days on market and price reductions and things like that. And this is quite honestly where a lot of real estate agents get some great information, but they're boots on the ground. They know what's going on. Well, Many the, the the good ones know what's going on in you their should. market, right? I <laughs> yes. mean, there's a lot of them that uh, you know they're they're just out there putting a sign up and think that's what's going to sell like it did in 2021. Here's a high level overview of just one of the factors a great real estate agent will walk you through the supply of homes for sale, and that how that impacts your process. Over the past few months, the number of homes for sale has increased. Good news when you move because it means you'll have more options as you search for your next home, but it also means buyers have more to choose from. So if your house doesn't stand out, it may take a bit longer to sale to sell. Available inventory is made up of new listings, homes that were just put on the market for sale, and active listings, homes that were already on the market but haven't sold yet. And if you look at data from Realtor.com, you can see a good portion of the recent growth is from active listings that are sticking around. If you're watching us on RonSiegelRadio.tv, any of our socials, or the ABC News and Talk AM 1490 FM 98.1 video feeds. I think it's 98.1. Right? I should know, right? You're I, seeing I would a, hope you yeah. know where you're at. but <laughs> Sometimes I do. Sometimes I, I don't. Was say, I the show broadcasts at 6 in the afternoon on ABC, Lisa. So that's, that's martini hour. Active <laughs> listings are greater than new listings. So if you look at the chart, the green bar and the blue bar were almost like overlays in 2021 and 2022. There's a bit of a spread in there right now. How it's impacting listing today, think of homes on the market like loaves of bread for sale in a bakery. When a fresh batch of bread is put out, everyone wants the newest and hottest one. But if a loaf sits there too long, it starts to get stale and fewer people want to buy it. The same goes for homes. New listings are the freshest and most sought after. But if a home isn't priced correctly, doesn't show well, or doesn't have an effective sales and marketing strategy behind it, it can sit on the market and become less appealing to buyers over time. Why do you think that so many of the partners of Ron Siegel Radio have their listings on TV immediately after listing them? Put them all there. An agent will help your house stand out and sell quickly. Time is important to you. You want to get it done. I don't know anybody that wants to have their house for sale. Right? They want it sold. It's a horrible thing. Right. It's. I mean, yeah. you want to have to have it set up your house like a museum for the next... And have to leave yeah, all the time? Exactly. All the time. By it's leaning on a pro, you'll make sure your listing is fresh, doesn't stick around long enough to go stale, and as the National Association of Realtors, NAR explains, quote, home sellers without an agent are nearly twice as likely to say they didn't accept an offer for at least three months. 53% of sellers who use an agent say they accepted an offer within a month of listing their home, unquote. Your agent will factor the recent inventory growth into their plan and create a customized selling strategy for your house. The supply of homes for sale can vary a lot. So they'll do things like share their valuable insights into what's happening with the supply in your market, help you price your home correctly, and create a marketing plan that gets your home noticed. Don't let your listing get stale. Reach out to a real estate agent today to make sure your listing is fresh and appeals to buyers from the start. It makes a big difference. And I know most of you don't know a great real estate agent. The guy or gal that just gave you a calendar that does not necessarily qualify them as a great real estate agent. They may be, but it doesn't qualify them simply because they came and put a door hanger out or gave you a calendar or something along those lines. If you want your house to sell fast, give me a call at 800-306-1990. I do not sell real estate. I do not have a horse in the race, but I will tell you because I talk to a lot of real estate agents and I have access to a whole lot of data. 
that I can put you in touch with a great real estate agent anywhere in the sound of my voice. And I'm sitting with one this morning. That is the real-time real estate segment brought to you by rsrmoney.com, rsrmoney.com.